Hey everybody, what is going on? Carter here. I'm doing good. Are you doing good? I'm doing good. So what I have for you today is another automatic knife. Uh, this one is pretty dang cool. You probably already know what it is, just because it is so iconic. This is the Benchmade Infidel. I guess technically it's the Benchmade The Infidel, according to the way it's printed on the pocket clip there. But this is a double action out the front knife. Double action meaning the button will deploy the knife as well as retract the knife. Unlike a single action knife like this Cupid clone here where pressing the button disengages the knife, pressing the button does not put the knife back in. It does not retract the blade. You got to do that manually. Um, so this one is quite cool in that you can do it all like so. It has a D2 blade, four inches in length. It is a dagger blade. It is sharp on both sides right there. You can see this cool uh, groove that it has down the middle, kind of their trademark groove right there. has a metal button here that's pyramid jimped, so you can grip it and pull it back or push it forward. Hard anodized aluminum handles with some grip right here has a deep carry pocket clip. See where it says, uh, like I said before, the Infidel right there. There's the Benchmade Butterfly. This is a very iconic knife right here. Uh, this is uh, Benchmade's only double action out the front. And in fact, I think it's their only out the front knife, other than the mini version of this. They do have a mini Infidel with, I think, a three inch blade. And then Benchmade also manufactures H HK knives. Um, and they have a couple OTFs, but as far as Benchmade themselves, this is the only OTF knife that they have. Um, and it has been around for quite a while. It is a very, very cool knife. I'm glad I picked one up. Got this used. Um, it's actually more used than I was anticipating. It was supposed to be uh, just fondled and fired a few times, but you can see it's obviously been carried. A lot of scuffs on the pocket clip there. Um, but, you know, the price was still good, and it just means I'm more likely to carry it. Well, in fact, I'm carrying it right now. Uh, so, in that respect, it actually turned out to be for the best, because now I'm carrying it. Uh, so, yeah, this fires out the front. It's actually quite a stout design. I, If I remember, I will post a video down below of somebody doing a uh, torture test on one of these. And it's a pretty practical torture test. Uh, basically, them just pushing it into quite uh, with a lot of force into some wood um, basically simulating a lot of force being pushed down on this blade uh, because this blade shape let's face it is meant for stabbing for piercing things like that um, and it actually holds up pretty well the blade play on this is about on par with every other double action out the front that I've owned uh, single actions tend to have less blade play. Of course, that's assuming it's a quality brand OTF. Uh, but this one is right on par. Nice D2 steel. This has the Benchmade matte satin. I really like it. Um, it's, it's kind of, in terms of its glare, it's similar to a stone wash, but it's not stone washed. I'm not sure how they do it because it's not, it's not a shiny satin. It's kind of a dulled gray satin. So uh, it, it's pretty cool. I really enjoy it. Um, I'll be doing a comparison between this and my Microtech Combat Trudon, my other double action OTF, uh, just so you can see the similarities. Um, right off the bat though, you'll know that the engagement button on this is on the front side as opposed to the, uh, the spine of the blade, which you see a lot. Um, and it actually it gives you a really good grip when you're going to engage this knife. Uh, you kind of fit into these grooves right here and there's no feeling that you're not going to be able to shoot this out. Um, and then you can turn it to the side like this and you got yourself a nice grip. You could also do it this way. Um, I think this is the, uh, the more natural way to do it. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to be carrying this and uh, showing it off. Everybody loves double action out the front knives. They just love them.
get a kick out of them. So uh, yeah, I'll be doing a comparison video on this and you know, you'll see this around. I'm sure I'll do some more automatic knife videos featuring this. Um, it's, it's a uh, very popular, popular blade. All right guys, take it easy. I'm out of here. Have yourself a good one.